What is multivariate testing? I know what you're thinking. Isn't that just like an A-B test? Well, unlike A-B testing, which only allows you to test two variables, multivariate testing allows you to test three out of four variables at a time. This way, you can test any three things like your subject line, sender name, content, or sending time all at once. With that said, let's set up our multivariate test in MailerLite. From your dashboard, click Create Campaign. Choose the multivariate campaign option. Enter your campaign name and choose up to three out of the four variables for testing. We're going to go with email subject, sender name, and email content for this tutorial. Enter your subject lines, sender names, preheader text, and then select your recipients. Keep in mind that you'll need to have at least 1,000 recipients to effectively test variations with multivariate test campaigns. If you have less than 1,000 recipients, your variations will be sent to all of these subscribers. Then click Next. Now you'll want to customize the content for your emails. Content is one of the variables that we're testing here, so we'll be creating two different email designs. Hop into the drag and drop editor and customize your design. When you're finished, hit Done Editing. You'll be brought to a screen showing the variations of your content. For the second email, we'll copy content one and then change it up a bit. We'll try a different header image and title text. Next, you'll be asked to select the size of your test group. This shows how many subscribers will receive each email. Below that, you can select what metric you'll use to determine the winner, and how many days you want the test to run before choosing that winner. This will give our subscribers time to open the email and give our test real results. Finally, you'll be able to do one final review of your campaign content and details. At the bottom of the page, you can select if you want to send your campaign now or send it later. If you select send time as one of the variables, you'll see a different screen after editing content. You won't be able to select the test size of your group. However, when you get to the final page to schedule the content, you'll be able to select different times to send the campaign. As your campaign runs, you'll be able to see which campaign performs best in your campaign dashboard. And that about covers it. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and remember to like and subscribe for more email marketing tips.